Kyla Brannigan with Amarillo Brewing Supply and today I'm going to show you how to put your shrink wrap on your wine bottles. And it's pretty simple, we have three methods to do this. We're going to go from least effective to most effective. We have the hair dryer, the steam method, and then the heat gun method. So right now I'm going to show you how to do this with the hair dryer. That was the hair dryer method. It's not the, the greatest method to choose. We did have some bumps right here. When you use your hair dryer, make sure it's on the highest heat possible and make sure that it's on the highest setting possible. Next up is the steam method. So we have our steam kettle here. When I use the steam method, I like to make sure that the water is absolutely full to the top. That way water droplets spit out and it seems to seal it better than just the steam itself. So we're going to turn this on and now we just wait for steam to happen. A lot slower than the hair dryer usually but I find that it makes a very smooth result. You're going to start at the top and work your way down very slowly and if there are any bumps along the way go over them again because those will bubble up and it won't look as pretty. And now we go on to the best method, which is the heat gun. Of course, it's not something you usually have on hand, so you have to go to the store and buy it, but it makes life easier. So that was the heat gun. You have to move very, very quickly because it works so fast and so well. I actually got a few little bumps on mine because I was going too slowly. You have to get the hang of twirling the bottle fast enough and holding your heat gun in one hand. So now you can take your labels and Set them on your wine bottles. And now you have a beautiful professional looking bottle that reflects the wine inside. I'm Shiloh Brannigan with Amarillo Brewing Supply. Please be sure to subscribe to our channel and be sure to check out our Facebook page at www.facebook.com slash Supply.